So this is my first laser that I've ever built. It's uh, I'm guessing about one and a half watts. It's 445 nanometer. It's running right around uh, 1.5 amps. And since there's no heat sinking, I'm guessing that that's going to work out to right around a uh, watt and a half. Um, it's a low light, high energy diode, so it's not going to be as bright as most blue lasers are. Uh, the beam is visible still, obviously with that kind of wattage. Um, but it's running off of two universal drivers. I think they can do one amp each. Um, and I used a, just a cheapo Deal Extreme flashlight here. It was like $18 or something. Not anything special. For the batteries, I'm using some 18650s. They are 2200 milliamp hours. Um, just got a clicky switch on the back, so that's it. Can't really see the beam in broad daylight like this, but if you take it into the dark, it's really visible. Um, I actually had to use my nice G2 lens for another laser, so right now this is actually a shitty plastic lens. And if, if I actually leave it on too long, it'll start to smoke because the laser's burning the plastic inside. But I'll just do a quick little demo here on my, on my desk. The plastic lens works very nicely for burning up close. I'm getting a lot of smoke. Um, then I can use I can actually use this with just some torch goggles. Don't have to go for the full welding mask or laser goggles. Um, you get a lot of burning power with this laser with not too much mm, brightness, I suppose. And for one thing I can tell you, this guy is pretty old. I've built about five lasers since it. And I can definitely tell that the beam's quieted down a little bit, if that makes any sense. Now, see what we have here. Got real nice burn in the wood there, just from screwing around. I probably could have got it nicer if I had focused the beam more. But I just wanted to do a brief demo. Um, this is my laser. It's the first one I built. Kind of got sentimental value. Um, if anybody out there is looking to have a laser built for them, I can set them up. Um, I basically only charge the cost of parts since it's a hobby of mine. So uh, if you'd like one, just message me at my YouTube screen name and I'll get back to you. I usually check it every day. Um, yeah, so that's about it, guys.